A contour map for a function f of x comma y is shown. If you start at the point negative one comma four and move in the negative x direction, does the function value increase or decrease? So looking at the graph for a moment, notice how we have the x values along the horizontal axis, we have the y values along the vertical axis, and we have the function values along the contour curves or level curves. We'll first locate the point negative one four, which should be here. Notice how the function value is eight at this location. But now from here, we want to move in the negative x direction. Let's sketch a horizontal line through the point that's parallel to the x-axis. So we're moving along in this line, but because we're moving in the negative x direction, we're moving in this direction here. And notice by the level curves, as we move to the left, or the negative x direction, we can tell the function values are getting larger or increasing. Notice here, the function value would be 12, here it would be 16, and so on. So we can say f of x comma y is increasing in this direction. Let's take a look at a second example. It's the same question, but now we're at the point two comma eight and moving in the negative y direction. So the point two eight is here. Notice how at this point the function value is 16. And now because we're moving in the negative y direction, let's sketch a vertical line that's parallel to the y-axis, which would be here. But because we're moving in the negative y direction, we'd be moving downward from this point, or in this direction here. And notice how as we move in this direction, the function values are getting smaller or decreasing. We're starting at a function value of 16, from here it would be 12, here it would be 8, and so on. So we can say f of x comma y is decreasing in this direction. I hope you found this helpful.